In this video, I will explain determine the exponential Fourier series for the full wave rectified sine wave shown in figure. Determine determine the exponential exponential Fourier series Fourier series for the full wave rectified sine wave shown in figure shown in figure this is the waveform x of t t this is the waveform full wave full wave rectified waveform zero one two three minus one minus two that is minus three this is the waveform find out the time period of the waveform here time period is uh, this one is t naught t naught is equal to one time period of the waveform t naught is equal to one t naught is equal to one means here uh, Amplitude is one. Here small t nut. This point is a small t nut plus capital T nut. Small t nut is equal to zero. Small t nut plus capital T nut is equal to one. Substitute zero here. Therefore, time period of the waveform is one. This is the sine wave. Sine wave here generally. A sine wave here 0 1 2 amplitude is 1 here minus 1 x of t is equal to x of t x of t is equal to a sin omega t a sin omega t here a is the amplitude of the wave for a is 1 sin Omega is equal to 2 pi by t, t, capital T. Here time period of the waveform is uh, to cover full cycle. After that, uh, the cycle is repeated. T is equal to 2. T is equal to 2. That is a sign uh, 2 pi by 2 into 2. That is equal to sin pi t. Sin pi t. This is the x of t waveform. Suppose pi is here, t is equal to 0. Sin 0 is 0. t is equal to 1. Sin pi. Sin pi. That is equal to sin pi means again sin pi is 0. And t is equal to half middle one half sin pi by 2 that is 1 and uh, t is equal to minus of sin uh, sin uh, uh, pi minus 1 by 2 that is minus sin pi by 2 that is minus 1 therefore this equation is satisfied x of t is equal to sin pi t here t naught time period of that waveform is 1 according to exponential uh, Fourier series x of t is equal to sigma n is equal to minus infinity to plus infinity c n e power j n omega naught t find here uh, sigma n is equal to minus infinity to plus infinity c n e power j n omega naught is uh, 2 pi by t naught into t where t naught is 1 time period of the waveform is 1 that is equal to sigma n is equal to minus infinity to plus infinity cn 
e power j n 2 pi t where since uh, t naught is equal to one time period of the waveform is one find out this quotient c n is equal to one by t naught capital t naught small t naught small t naught plus uh, capital t naught x of t e power minus j n omega naught t dt this is the equation we know that t naught value is 1 1 by 1 here small t naught is 0 0 plus capital t naught is 1 x of t e power minus j n omega naught is a 2 pi by t naught into t dt integral that means integral 0 to 1 x of t e power minus j n 2 pi t naught is 1 since uh, time period of the waveform t naught is 1 that is 2 pi by 1 is 1 j e power minus j n 2 pi t dt here in that uh, 0 to 1 interval um, the waveform x of t is uh, a sin uh, a sin that is a sin pi omega t a is equal to 1 that is sin pi t x of t is uh, 0 to 1 x of t is sin pi t pi into t here it is not uh, e power minus j n 2 pi t dt integral of e power ax sin bx is we know that integral of e power ax sin bx x is equal to e power ax by a square plus b square a sin bx minus b cos bx this is the formula you used here integral 0 to 1 e power minus j to n pi t sin pi t dt here a is minus a to n pi b is minus a to n pi b is pi according to this formula integrate e power minus this one is e power e power minus a to n pi t pi a square plus b square where a is minus j to n pi whole square b square b is pi that is pi square a a is minus j to n pi sin bx means sin sin pi t minus pi into cos pi t in the interval 0 to 1. This is the, uh, after integrating this one, the waveform is like that, the equation is like that. That is equal to e bring this one here. One by minus in minus whole square minus into minus j whole square four n pi square plus pi square bring outside e power j two n pi t 
into minus a 2n pi sin pi t minus pi cos pi t 0 to 1. This one is 0. OK. Uh, here, that is equal to 1 by minus into minus plus j square is minus 1 pi square minus 4n pi square. 0, first 1 is substituted here. e power minus a 2n pi. e power minus j 2n pi. Substitute 1 here. Sin sub t is equal to 1. That means um, sin pi is 0. Here, cos pi. Cos pi is minus 1. First, first substitute upper limit. 1 here. T is represented with 1 here. Minus a 2n pi. Sin pi 1. Sin pi 1 means sin pi. That is 0. This value is 0 minus pi cos pi cos pi is minus one minus into minus plus that is a plus pi and uh, substitute zero minus lower limit that is the reason we use minus e power zero sin pi into zero sin zero is zero again cos zero here t is zero cos zero is one that is minus pi That is equal to 1 by pi square 1 minus 4n e power minus a 2n pi. That means cos 2n pi minus j sin 2n pi. That is the e power minus j 2n pi. Cos 2n pi is 1 minus 0. Therefore, e power minus a 2n pi value is 1. 1 into pi minus into minus plus that is pi finally cn is equal to 2 pi by pi square into 1 minus 4 n square here 2 by 2 by pi 1 minus 4 n square here n is equal to 0 n is equal to 0. Magnitude response mod c n is equal to mod 2 by pi 1 minus 4 n square. For different values of n, n 0, 1, 2, 3 and so on. Mod c n mod c n for 0, 2 pi by pi, 2 pi by pi, for 1, substitute is 1, 1 minus 4 into 1 square, 1 minus 4, 1 minus 4 is uh, minus 3, 2 by 3, minus 3 pi, mod is 2 by 3 pi, 2 by 3 pi, for n is equal to 2, 2 square, 4, 4, 16, 16 minus 1 minus 16 minus 15 by using mod, therefore 2 pi by 15, like that. Suppose n is equal to 0, minus 1, minus 2, and so on. Mod cn is equal to, mod cn is equal to 2 by pi, same values. 2 by 3 pi, 2 by 15 pi. By using these values, draw the magnitude response mod cn. Here, n for 0, the value is 2 by pi. For 1, the value is 2 by 2 by 3 pi. For 2, the value is 2 by 
15 5 and so on like that for minus 1 minus 2 by not minus 2 by 3 pi plus 2 2 by 15 5 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and so on here plus 3 plus 4 and uh, minus 4 and so on this is the magnitude uh, response of that waveform 